breathe about the nutrition <clears throat> facts. Are you nervous? A little bit. You don't think it's keto? You think uh, keto crate would do that to you? Hello, my Choo Choo family. I'm your fun-loving happy vlogger, Tom Choo Choo. You know, I've never stared at you do it. <laughs> <laughs> I just did that right now. How do you feel weird. about it? <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Keto Crate Unboxing Taste Test yeah. with my sister, Sandy Cheeks. Hello. Today we'll be unboxing the April box. I don't know what's gonna be in here. It better not be something that's left over from Easter. I think it's the I think one. so. I think yay! it's the fourth one. So yay! Our favorite videos. To yes, make. and if you want to get a keto crate like mine, <laughs> why are you laughing? That was so choppy. Oh okay, yeah. If you want, <laughs> okay, let me do it. Uh, if you want to get a keto crate like mine, use my discount code to get $10 off on the first sign up. I don't know why she keep laughing. <laughs> but on that note, please like and subscribe and hit that notification. Yikes! <laughs> subscribe guys, just subscribe to this channel so you can stop. Moving on! <laughs> Let's get to unboxing. Several bad puns later. <laughs> okay, we're back after we lay everything out by my sister. We? <laughs> <laughs> Let's start with our first item to our right. Right to left? Yes. Your favorite fat snacks brand. It matches my nails! Wow. Mini fat cookies, snacks, chocolate mini cookies. chips. We haven't let you guys know that we will rate from 1 to 5 but we have so many decimals in the middle. <laughs> oh yeah, don't mind me. <laughs> yeah, my sister is a very... Precise rater. Tough, Harsh rater. Tough rater. It's very flowery, it seems like. They give you like 8 little tiny dots. It's... <laughs> Yeah, it's not a lot. I'm excited. It looks like Chips Ahoy, but like fat version. Yeah, fat snacks. How cute. It's keto friendly. Great. Cheers. It's very crumbly. Mm hmm. It does not taste like Chips Ahoy. I tell you that. I like cookies. It's not crispy or crumb. It's not crispy or like crunchy. Yeah. But it's. Good. It's made of almond flour, coconut flour, butter, and chocolate chips. If you guys want to know about how to make keto cookie, I'll put the link up there. It smells heavenly. I like the flavor more than the texture. But it's pretty expensive, so let's move on. There's only eight of them. <laughs> there's eight? How do you know? Is that it? No, it looks like there's only eight of them. No, there's more than eight. Okay, there's eight in here. So we there's only 10. have oh, 11. 11. I That's give snacks. it a four out of five. I give a 4 out of 5 too. I mean, wow. I like chocolate chips cookies. You so. just like chocolate in general. Alright, moving on. I don't know about this. Scuda. What is this? <laughs> is this another la- Scuda. Chili maple, Django, chili arable. If you have Pumpkin seen our seeds. previous- I have a feeling this is gonna go to our mother. I think it might be the same thing. And but this one has a bigger bag compared to the yeah, last the one. Yeah, the other one was tiny. <laughs> it's resealable. We should start like rating their packaging. Wow. Mike. Give me a hand. I don't want too much. I didn't ask how we much can you save. wanted. Yeah, oh, okay, that's it. You can have some. <laughs> <laughs> We're really not like pumpkin seed fans. We're not a fan of pumpkin Cheers. seed. It's like a, okay, it's definitely more flavorful than the last it's one. It's like a one out of five. It's definitely more flavorful than the last one. I just don't care have. for it. So what do you rate Scooter? That's probably not even how you say it, but it sounds cooler. Two. Okay. Generous. Moving on. Wow. After all, they are all under five grams of carbs, so... Crispy cuts, pork rinds, sweet chipotle flavor. Your favorite. You sweet love pork chipotle. Rinds. I love chipotle too. Chipotle is my life. Ooh. What's up with all the chili? I don't know, but there's like five pieces in here. There's not that many of them, but I like the smell of it though. You do? Yeah. They don't smell like anything. Smell chipotle. Mmm. Oh, it's fat. The flavor is really ooh, oh, a little spicy. The spicy kick at the end. Wait, it's really good. The flavor is really good. The seasoning. Mm -hmm. I like it. I like it. It's good. Mm. Rating. Oh, it's so spicy. I give it like a 
a 4.8. Oh. It's really good. I Why are you flavor. being so generous Because today. the flavor is really good. Okay. I was like, okay. Yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> I would give like a 3. I would give him like a 4.5. I'm sorry. Oh, wow. Less than yeah. me. Yeah, I, I rate by the fact that it's really good. But I also rate that it's not enough. Moving on. Ooh, what do we have here? Garlic, Garlic and, and herb. herb. Real beef stick. They always include like a stick, huh? <laughs> I'm not very good with it. <laughs> Oh. It's not it's not me, fam. How is it? it? Smells really good. It doesn't smell as good as the other ones. No, it doesn't. It tastes just like it smells. Not as good as the others. <laughs> tastes more like a ham. Yeah, yeah. Right? Yeah. Like a sausage. Um I give it like a one out of five. It doesn't intrigue me. Well, this one's all right, but um, two. One, still, like beef stick is still not my favorite. So, ooh, we got Second two sticks beef. today. What's this one? Think jerky. That's the brand. Protein. Protein. Ooh, this one looks better and more breakable. Smells better, definitely. I was wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh it's yeah. It's more reddish. This smells so good. This is it. This it smells like dog about. treat. <laughs> is it really good? Like it smells. Mm -hmm. Way better. You can definitely taste more of the beef. I think it's the seasoning that's different. Way peppery. Mm. The other one tastes like it had no pepper. Yeah, the other one should have more garlic flavor. I didn't the taste not. any garlic. Nope. Four out of five. Wow. Mm -hmm. That comparison is crazy. Yeah, one out of one? five, four out of five. So good. I give you two. You I rated them the same. Yeah, good. I, they all taste the same to me. Moving on. What is Legendary this? Legendary food, blueberry flavored. It looks like a pop tart. Yeah, it's a tasty pastry. <laughs> You've never had a pop tart? I do have. I I did have pop tart. Isn't that? It? It's blubbery flavored. This should not be keto though. So I'm so surprised that it's keto. Are you nervous? A little bit. You don't think it's keto? You think uh, keto crate would do that to you? No, I don't think keto Absolutely. crate would do that to me. But hold on. No one cares about the nutrition facts. <laughs> it's only four grams of net carbs. Okay, I guess. Absolutely. It smell good? I don't know how that smells. What the? Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Is it smells toxic, yo. Is this the wrapper I'm smelling or? It smells like a little bit like chemical, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, well. Are we you gonna have take... half or just a little bit? Oh, uh, just a little bit. <laughs> I don't want to die. I'm gonna do it like this, and then we can have this half. Yeah, I don't know. Ugh. Oh. Yeah, it's so jelly-like. Oh. Not even jelly. It's like, oh, I don't know, fam. I would just want half of it. Dang but it. this looks like pop tart, though. Mmm. Mmm. It's and it really tastes sweet. like bubblegum. Yeah, it's really, really sweet. It tastes like bubblegum flavor. I wonder if you can put in the toaster. Toast or microwave on low? I'm gonna give that a zero out of five. I give you one to make it accessible to keto people who That's want true. to who eat. That's true, who can't have an actual pop yeah. Keto cookies! People who have diabetes and stuff, you can still come some. No, don't. Something like There's this. There's chemicals in there. <laughs> This is snickerdoodle flavor. Clean ingredients full of goodness. It says three grams net carbs per serving. Oh, so there's two cookies. Cookie. Oh, are we gonna eat the whole cookie or share one? Oh, we should share one. Ooh, snickerdoodle, I love. Cinnamon. Mmm, I like the cinnamon. Mmm. Mmm, it's sticking on my teeth. None of the keto cookies are crispy or crunchy, but it's really good. It's very cakey. Mm hmm. Yeah, but the flavor is so good. It's like eating a cinnamon. Rating? 4.5. Really? Mm hmm. I like this one. I like uh, cinnamon, so. 5 out of 5 for me. Ooh! That was really good. Ooh! Keto cookies from Perfect Keto. You've outdone yourself. Moving on to Proudly Pure Parmesan Crips. Crisps? Why would you put it in a box like this? No idea. It looks like jello. Like you just. Oh my god, you're dropping crumbs. Poor packaging. Negative rating. My cat is gonna eat it. Oh gosh. 
awful. See? Whoa, it's oh. so crispy and crumbly. What is this? It's like it's... chips. Oh, it smells so freaking good. Oh, it's oh, it's a crisp. It's bacon parmesan crisp. Oh, cheers. Cheers. Mm. You like this? I like it. It's a little bit hard though. The flavor is the most flavorful. crunchy thing we've gotten in this whole box, so yeah. I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah it's right. super flavorful. The cheese punch is really strong. Oh, hold on. Ooh. Wow. It feels like the rice cracker. A little bit. Yeah. That's really good. Mm. I give it a 4.3. 4.3. Oh, you've been giving pretty good rating. It's been pretty, pretty good. I don't know. The more I chew, the more the more the rating goes down. Yeah. yeah. Why? The more I'm deducting it. It's really hard. Eat it like chips. But it's not digesting. It's not dissolving when you try to grind it. What do you give it? Four. Oh, okay. That's still not bad. Yeah. It's really good. The flavor's really freaking good. You have to try the flavor. Packaging is awful. I know. There's a little crack right here and it's dropping hella crumbs. Alrighty. Cheeto snack chips. <laughs> Are those Doritos? <gasps> Barbecue flavor. They look like spicy Doritos. It looks really mm. good. Oh, Ben. Bon Genius Gourmet. I've never seen all these brands. I've never heard one of them. One bag is 170 serving. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it looks more red on the picture, but it's orange in person. Oh, that does not smell very good. I was expecting red. Me too, like hot, spicy chips. That yeah. so good. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. 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 Oh, really good. Mm. Five out of five. Holy shit. Oh, really good. I like the... It's very light and airy and crispy. Mm-hmm. And the flavor is really good. Mmm. Barbecue. Light barbecue. What do you think? I like it. Mm, 4.8. Because it's really good. It tastes really... Like if you ever wanted a chips and you're on keto, this... This is the move. Yeah, like this is Like the it. only move. But it doesn't taste like barbecue though. I think so. It tastes like peanuts at the end though. I think I said 5 out of 5 when I first took a bite because oh. I, I freaked out and it was really good. Okay. Yeah. Oh gosh, cocoa dusted almonds. Does that mean it's chocolate? We haven't had chocolate. Cocoa dusted almonds. Oopsies, that was horrible. It's okay, give me your hand. From where? It is from Keto Farm. Oh, okay. High fat, low carb, real food snacks. Two grams net carbs. I'm not a big fan of almonds. I'm not a big fan either, but cocoa covered? Okay. Mmm, 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 mmm. Wow, it smells like a dessert. I just melted a little bit. Did you melt? No? I didn't melt because I was expecting like chocolate. It's like brown sugar. Mm hmm Yeah. Not a huge fan of almonds, but 4 out of 5. 4.9. Actually, yeah. I'm gonna bump it up, but like 4.5 out, mm -hmm. out of 5. That's so good! That zero one point, it's because I just don't like almonds. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Guess what? <laughs> Uh, cookie. It's it's a uh, shortbread, <laughs> something like that. Shortbread keto cookie mix. Oh, oh. we have to bake this. Keto no. great, you guys make us do some crazy things. Wait. Yeah, really? it's making you bake it. This but, calls for kitchen cam. But that's too much work. You need it to preheat really that oven. It really is too oven. much work. Three hundred fifty. But we can't not do it. Yeah, you need to preheat. Do you have a cup of butter? Of course. Do you have a large egg? Of course. Do you have parchment paper and a rolling pin? Oh yes. my god, this is a lot of work. I do. We're gonna have to be rolling it here. That's not too bad. Okay. But damn, rolling it and everything, like dough. Don't you wanna do it? Dough. <laughs> Don't know. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be right back. Yeah, we need to wash our hands. Alrighty. We're back. <laughs> After we preheat. Preheated. Preheated our oven at 350, 350 
This is so much work. We were not expecting this. I saw this in the package and I started laughing because I was like, oh my god. Y'all gonna make us do something crazy right now. So let's do it. All right, so right here we have two sticks of butter. We have to add one large egg, which Tom will do right the honors. Yeah. Is that what I said? Yeah. Preheat the oven, which you did. Step two is combine the mix, butter, and egg, and stir. So, okay, then let's put the powder first before first? I put the egg, yeah. Why, you weirdo? Oh, shit. This smells so good. Mmm, smells, smells so bread. sweet. All right. Where is this mixer from? It is from Keto and Co. Oh, Shortbread okay. cookie mix. It makes 16 buttery and crisp cookies. It smells so dang good. I swear, this is too oh buttery. God. Yeah, two sticks of butter. Holy cow. Yeah, that's a lot of butter. But like, whatever. Mix your thing. We both washed our hands with yes. plenty of soap and water. I'm excited. I haven't played with dough in so long. I thought you make cookies all the time. Yeah, but not always from scratch. This is not from scratch. You literally okay, just Okay, I mean put like, I mean like, okay, I, I do it like the ones where I don't have, oh, you're right, I do do this a lot. Yeah. Why did I, why did this feel like a lot more work? Because the fact that we oh, actually have to get up and It's because we it. had to make the dough. I usually yeah. make, get the ones that are, the dough's already pre-made, I just have to take it out and pop it in the oven. That's why. <laughs> that easy? But brownies and cakes, I have to do this. Oh my god. I always make everything from scratch, so. Your turn. <laughs> how, how long do we have to mix Until it? Until smooth dough forms. What does that even mean? Just one big dough? You're a horrible mixer. I think this is good enough, this is good. right? Yeah. Okay. After that, roll the dough between two sheets of parchment paper to a quarter of an inch thick. We're not going to do that. We're just going to... Touch we're it. just gonna touch it and then and to make, make it, it into balls. yeah, and we're gonna smack it into like little tortillas. Yep, <laughs> we'll do that because we don't want to do the whole rolling. Too much work. Yeah, I'm excited. You can do it. You know, I'm I don't think you're gonna like it. Short shortbread. I don't think you're gonna like it. Why? It smells like coconut a little bit. I swear I washed my hands, y'all. No, you should do it. I make cookies. Ew! This is so greasy. I know. Instantly. That's why I was like, I don't want to do it. Ew. Okay, done. <laughs> what the? Smash it. Don't oh, you make good. shortbread cookies? Oh, oh, look, that looks so good. If it's too much, it's okay. We're all about eyeballing here. Yep. And guesstimating. I feel like there's <laughs> more than that. <laughs> I feel like a machine. <laughs> Welcome to our chocolate factory. <laughs> Fun! Now, okay. how do I lift it up without it? <laughs> oh, God. It's yeah. not terrible. What are we gonna do with this? Hope. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna re roll it. Yeah. Just re roll it, because at least now we know the amount. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Fun? How many are we putting in one? Uh, well, you took out four sheets, and each will be four. Okay. Alright, cookies. <laughs> <laughs> it's very crumbly. Yeah, it's getting dry. Oh my god, my arms are so sore because I have to lift so high up. You can see the difference, right? This is much, much bigger. It is why it is. It's good enough. Is shortbread just the same as cookies but softer? Please leave in the comments. Because you said you don't like shortbread. So oh, I you're wearing your signature t-shirt. I know. Good for you. Shameless self promo. <laughs> Get your Sandy Cheeks merch at well, sandycheeksmerch.com. Yeah, I put the link already in the description box. Yeah, so. this one's my favorite. This one's my favorite color too, the gray one. Uh huh. And it's honestly one of the most comfortable shirts I own. Okay, here you go. Is your oven not ready yet? I don't know. I thought it would beep. No, it wouldn't. <laughs> oh! It wouldn't beep. Even when it's at the temperature, it's... No, what no, the it's hell is this off. little thing? I told you, that's it. Okay, we'll be right back. <laughs> I need to wash my hand before I shut this off. <sighs> okay. What a mission. This is taking forever. We did it! Yeah, we finally did it. We did it. We made the cookie shortbread from Keto Crates. 
Unfortunately, we have to make it our own. <laughs> On our own. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, we have to do a taste test, even though there is burnt stuff. Yeah, we burned the little bits on the bottom. But, but you can totally see it. Totally fine. <laughs> Um, and we totally broke a piece, so we're just gonna munch on the ones yep. we broke first. There you go. Oh goodness! Cheers. Cheers. Oh, it's so warm still. Mm. <laughs> it's so dry. It's so fucking dry. <laughs> it's not sweet at all. By it's the not way. bad. It's just really dry. I like that the edges and everything is lightly crispy. Mm -hmm. It's good, but really dry. I taste the coconut flour. Yeah, I can definitely taste the coconut. You can have it. You don't like it that much? You like it? Rating? <laughs> I give it a solid two out of five. I give you a solid two. Too much work. Yeah. But other than that, I think the flavor is good, and I like the crispiness on the side. You should definitely check out my recipe because that one is much easier than this one. Yeah, does it taste better? <laughs> Way better because what is it's that chocolate rating? chips cookie. Oh, okay. It's six out of five. That wins by a landslide because it's chocolate chips. <laughs> I love <laughs> chocolate chips. Okay, so that's picks our favorite. Of oh this yeah. Box of April. Do you know what yours is? I, only I think have, so. I only have these two on my side. Let's put it back up. Okay. All right. All right. What are your top two? My top two is this. Oh, those two? Yeah. Okay. My top two. Really? Snickerdoodle cookie and the cocoa almond, surprisingly. I actually like the fast so snacks too. Good. So, it just, I personally like this, but it, it's just too hard for me. So, yeah, these are all really good. These are, these, yeah, these, these chips were all are really, really good. good. So, you know, this. This month the keto crate is really, really good. good. So surprisingly, there were yep. more favorites in this one. I've never given such high ratings before. Mm -hmm. so I know. know. <laughs> Yum. Anyway, thanks Sandy for being here and to do this crazy kitchen unboxing keto crate with me. On that note, please like and subscribe and hit that <laughs> notification bell so you don't miss any of our update. Okay? My channel is all about keto and everything mukbang. And that's it. Cheers. Bye. On that note, please like and sus. On that note, please like and subscribe. <laughs> the B comes before the S. It's not SBS. Sub subscribe.